I have a feeling that this mission will be one of those that I can uh, keep on failing again and again. <laughs> at. Uh, hey, Freddy. Guide the woodlanders to whatever you think they should loot. They'll listen to you. Show those rats what happens when you mess with the scouts, Liam. Listen, I want to be sure you understand that once this sabotage is all through, I don't plan on sticking around. You're leaving? To where? Of course I'm heading out, you ninny. <laughs> Need to catch up to the Ivy Wayne lassies. You know, Belladora and Dorabella. They were out on the creek when the rats came. They made it to safety because of me. You really are a hero, Mr. Cornsilk. Aye. I reckon there were a good 30 rats, and I bravely held them off while they scampered out to safety. After a good fight, I must have downed a dozen or so, yeah. and the beasties finally overpowered me. And there I was, making good with the maker, prepared to become a honey-roasted meal when a massive owl came from out the night. With the rats distracted, I made my daring getaway. That's strange. I remember the story going differently. Oh, and you were there, I suppose. Actually, I was. And I suppose you mean to tell me you were partnered with the Great Owl, too. Planned to take all the credit with some wild story about directing the massive creature to take out the rats and rescue my hide? Uh. Oh, yes. That'll impress the village for sure. Liam the far fetched. Teller of tales taller than his own ego. What? <laughs> You've made a better bard than Scout. Now, a real hero has to watch over the Ivy Wayne lassies. So I'll take you. That sure is one strange mouse. Listen, I... You're leaving? Of course I'm head... Hmm. Wow! Let's do this Aye. again then. That's incredible. Well, that's a whole daring tale unto itself, but I haven't time. I must be off to aid that fair maiden. You should have been a scout, Mr. Cornsilk. That's quite a compliment. But no, this mouse would rather live the simple life of a tavern keep. No better way to build strength than to hoist kegs that could best a badger, I do say. If you ever want to work on your strength, I could always use an extra set of paws in the cellar. Especially what with this rat Armageddon and all. Yes, well... I certainly might have to take you up on that offer. That sure is one strange mouse. And he heads over here for some reason or another. <clears throat> Mr. Liam should be getting to them mousers. Alright. <clears throat> Claire. What did you say? Mining records. Fascinating, really. There we are. Oh, jeez. Um. What happened with all the other moles? That's something I'm still wondering. I kind of feel like they are. Whoa. Fish? <laughs> Those moles sure know how to preserve a trout. Um, I'm missing something. Yeah, I'm missing uh, this. Okay. And then I guess I'm gonna have to close all all of these somehow. I think I smell some yeah, smelling jam. Please hurry. 
One second, please. Thank you. Hey, hey the rats, could you I can't let these on my own. I think I'll take them for myself. Onward! Mm. I doubt I... Wow, what the fuck? <laughs> wow. Okay, it's on <coughs> this side, okay. Get to there. And no, I can't take. Okay. <sighs> Missing something. There is something I'm not seeing. What the hell? What did you find? Oh, I've got some nuts and berries in here. What am I supposed to do? Yeah, I I know I can Ah, oh, okay, it's like that. I thought it was, uh, you know, get down and, uh, you know, kind of drag yourself up or not walking across. Oh well. We've got to get past these barrels. That's not what I'm looking for. But... Sorry, Mrs. Thatcher. Ah, oh, red wall. And look at these. Um... Oh, I do love these. Is that that guy for some, something? Um, <clears throat> so it wasn't there. Simple ingredient. There's something saw something up there. Looks like a piece of paper though, but Yeah, that's a piece of paper, isn't it? As to something else. up there. Thank you. <laughs> Meanwhile, everyone down there is like having a picnic. You know, I heard them taking out something to eat. Or at least talking about it.
why that just felt like it. Okay, this one's for me. We were heading towards them. First one to catch me a mousey doesn't get their head on a pipe. Well, well, well. Look here. Where are these whelps keeping the good stuff? Don't worry, Captain. They won't get far. I smell some over here. They smell of brine. Wait a minute. They smash the pickles. Why would they do that? Why were we sneaking oh, no. towards them? Something and there they are. They ran past these guys. Okay. <clears throat> I doubt it, but you know. Feeling that oh. no idea what the hell I shot, but okay. <laughs> that guy, yes. Need to get around somewhere. How though? a little bit. Did the rats just run past, <laughs> past them or? What a shit, I've gone 18 minutes, <laughs> 16 minutes and I have been doing like absolutely nothing. I'll tell the captain. 
I think I shot in the wrong order. Pretty damn sure about that. Something besides whimper for your lunch yet. Trap them in corners. Don't let them get to the rafters. Do whatever you've got to do. They're sabotaging the supplies. Oh, I'm gonna skin them alive. I got them And anything else? Look at it. Find me no. those mice, or you'll okay, be the one served for dinner. <laughs> what are you lazy boats doing, huh? Get back to work! What's that? What did you say? Will you lot do something besides whimper for your lunch, eh? Ouch! Oh, me head. <laughs> and that guy like, oh shit, or... I don't know. He's dead! Oh, woe is this day! Oh, Captain's been cased from the great ship and has walked the plank to Hell's Gate. And a barrel, no less. Sure to take it at least a badger to snuff him out. Sink me, I can only trust me eyes. I doubt it. <laughs> okay, let's Everyone, leave. stick together. Help each other along. No one gets left behind. Wait, he's still alive. And, and now, the mice are getting away. 
So he's alive and we're getting away. I have a feeling this will be a runner mission. I have a strong feeling about that. There's a ship over there. Find those mice! Find them! We should have taken eight Where minutes. do we go now? Oh, Mr. Liam, there be this air lever over by Dime, and uh, if he pull any lever, he Dime be opening up. And the dam will release the river right into the camp! Purr, boy, okay. And I suppose it'd be sweeping all ye rats away. What you think? Yes! Klimba, that's genius! Oh, her. Up there! Don't let them escape! Pull the lever! They don't seem to uh, worry about the water, they seem to kind of enjoy it. <laughs> ah, fine, you disgusting ding bottoms. You snot nosed ferrety wretches. You better run, you nasty little mouselings. Although, you might not like who you find that way. Don't listen to him, Liam. Keep running. Liam and the Woodlanders escaped Camp Silver Sands and succeeded in washing away the rats. But the scouts still had a ways to go before reaching the Winsome Wraith. Liam feared the Lily Grovers would only slow them down, and time was of the essence in saving Sophia's life. All right. Sophia, Fraby, and I are continuing onward to the Winsome Wraith then. I suppose you'll all be coming along? I'm not walking into the house of a stoat. No, no. These supplies aren't going to do any good in the north. We've got to bring them back south, to Lily Grove. The scouts will have great need of them in rebuilding all our homes. It's the least we can do to help. We've got each other, and we'll be careful this time. We won't be caught unaware again. Especially now that those rats are all miles away down the river. Very well. Sophia, Fraby and I are going on to the Winsome Wraith. All of you, stay together and stay safe, all right? Mr. Liam, what is it, Glimber? Oh, I'm not much for Lily Gruff, I'm not. I'm just a lonely groundskeeping mole with no more grounds to keep her. Me a boy could be helping you on your journey. Well, Glimber, uh, I think maybe... Liam, can I talk to you? Liam, I think we should take Glimber with us. I hate the idea of leaving him behind too, but he's too slow. We need to get to the Winsome Wraith, and we've already lost too much valuable time. But Liam, he's scared. Besides, his digging claws are what got us out of Camp Silver Sands alive. We may be needing them again. Well, sure. <laughs> But he's afraid of his own two feet. What will we do if we're attacked? My mission is to get you to the Wraith, not a lone mole. You don't sound like yourself, Liam. The Liam I know would do anything to help a lonely, vulnerable critter. <sighs> You're right. I'm sorry. Of course we will bring Glimber with us, if that's what he wishes. There. That's the Liam I'm marrying. And so Glimmer joined them on their journey, and they all bid farewell to the other woodlanders. More determined than ever, Liam and his friends walked north along the edge of the creek. Slowly but surely the hours ticked by, and before they knew it the sun was near setting. In the distance they could see that a storm was fast approaching, and when they finally reached the abandoned fishing village, it was practically upon them. Pontadaria. Alright. I can't wait for one. Okay, so. Once. <coughs> Jeez, we actually have a party now. Cool. 
Oh, Alright, so. You're stinking them on. stoats drink tea. Next time. Oh, I sure could be using Next a warm taker. Yeah, and yeah, that should have taken like I eight heard minutes. Or something, invented but tea. you know me. I miss the obvious things. Oh, don't tease. But I do see there's a jam oh, there. Though. I just mean I'm quite certain any good Thank you. will have fine tea. Have a good day.